So, what are we doing today? We're doing that existing. Um, Doing sculpt timber challenge. Crab man. Transform. Fit to screen. All of that was terrible. All right. So go ahead and just make a little platform. Crab man. Let's go ahead and look up some crabs. Drop in some reference. You guys can't see what I'm doing, can you? Mm -hmm. uh, all right, looking up crabs. Cool crabs. I like the colors of this one. This looks cool. Also very cool. Um, let's, see, let's search unusual crab. Whoa, that's fucking nuts. It's wild how much they look like spiders. Mm -hmm. Cute. <laughs> that's really cute. So very bizarre. No, it's because it's not a real crab. Fuzzy, fuzzy boy. All right. I think this is a good amount to start with. So let's go ahead and start saving things. We'll do nine folder. Grab a man. Ref. Grab a man. Reference. Grab. One. Two. Three. And it's funny that they seem to die in the same kind of positions, just like a spider as well. All right. So back to Blender. I'm going to turn off desktop, back to Blender. And we're going to drop in some images. Just 
just drop all of them, right? No. Just one at a time. Perfect. All right. So, save, grab man, grab man. And start with just blocking in some shapes. Which way is right? Three, one. Okay, perfect. I have to just respond to a message really quick. When I get some money back, I'll purchase your services. Looking forward to it. Do it. Appreciate your great day in the meantime. Okay, bada boom. Bye. Right. So I think we'll just start by making a crabby shape. Do, do, do. Oh, I have to enable references, install under add-ons, quad. Oh. Okay. Real quick. Come around. No, library, quick shape. <sighs> Which one's the right one? 2.93, that seems right. Install. Perfect. We'll see how this goes. So, to start with. Remember how to do symmetry. do it without it. So I like this flat top here, how round that is. I think that's really appealing to me. I really love all these little <clears throat> small shapes. So I think we'll do kind of a combo, these two for like the head. Something like... Okay. We're gonna do symmetry, so I just do that. An empty plane axes. Pull this mirror. Turn on mirror. Why? Clear. There we go. So got kind of this crappy shape now. Yeah, so we just slap a sub D on there. Oh, we didn't like it. Go back to Twitch chat. Hey, what's up, Breeze? Welcome, welcome. It's been a while. 
I forgot on my camera as well. <clears throat> Hello. I think I just crashed this. Oh, I got it. I know it's it started coming down. It's been thundering for like an hour now. I would start with Crab Man. Delete this busted photo. Okay. So we have to remake that. Oh no, we have to do. Stall, lumber add on, quick shape, and hmm. this time I'm going to start from the no, yeah, this is fine. So, kind of repeat that shape from before, and it references quick, bada boom. Save. No, Shift F. Do something like this. Yeah. And slap a mirror modifier on there. Empty plain X keys. Call it mirror. Mirror. There we go. And why make this quite a bit bigger? That's why. Now we're going to look at it from the top. Back in here. And if I remember correctly, it's shift will cut out of it. So I kind of want. Okay, wrong thing. Okay, and then from the side again. Control. We'll just do this cut real simply. Oops. One, three. <laughs> okay, kind of funny looking, but that's okay. Shift F, we're going to apply this. Now go to Control Tab, Sculpt Mode, so that, Control R. And we'll just smooth it. Smoothie. Mesh filter. Smooth. Yeah. Let's make sure to turn on. What? Anyway. Gosh darn it. I'll go ahead and just kind of tweak it a little bit. Kind of pull that back and front as well. Yeah, he's got to get some eyes, right? I like the little, little eyes this guy has. So do something like that. <laughs> Cute. Yeah. Super cool. Oh, interesting. Uh, back to object mode. All transforms.
Heat. Mm, lasting. And then let's also grab a draw sharp. I'm just gonna go in here and kind of carve out some of these shapes a little bit more. Yeah, that looks super fucking cool. I like that. And one more time, we'll actually remesh it because I think it was scaled incorrectly. Okay, looking good. Looking good. I like it. We'll lock it. So, crab body acquired. Now, let's go ahead and start making some legs. So, back to this front view. Shift F. And. It's really like a crab man, right? Crab man. So what about it will be man-like? Hmm. Hmm. Should give him a little face right here. <laughs> be gross, but I like it. Go back to sculpt mode. Spiny. It's spiny. Spiny boy. And yeah, I am just using my mouse for now because I like to save my wrist for when I really need it. Otherwise, I hurt myself too early on because uh, repetitive motion injury. Let's check out what it looks like. Shaded view. Cool, 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 cool. Mm. Yeah, uh, you know what? Crab man. I think I'll just make like a writer. <laughs> Maybe like a person like kind of fused in to the front of it here. Right here, like a crab centaur. Crab tar. Yeah, we'll do that. So I really want to make all the legs. Shift F, one, nine. I'm gonna go ahead and base them off this guy. So they're just gonna, they got this one section here, bigger section, so we'll do the first section. Section. Come on. Hat. Yeah. And then the second section, like this longer one, so let's do that first. So like that. Shrink it. And hit shift F. Go to control tab. Scroll down. To control R and I click. Wait, shift R. Control R. Foot. Shift R. Control R. And I can go ahead and just start smoothing it a little bit. Give it some smooth and rush. Control tab, object mode, machine smooth. Yeah. <clears throat> That's the thing. 
should probably be the same for this one. Object, set origin, object geometry, control tab, play, transforms, play, scale. I want to be able to keep the corners and then smooth them. Sure. Let's give it some noise. Sporkies. Okay. Now, a few more leg segments. We got this curved one. And bottom one, which we'll do is two segments actually. That, then, bam, crappy. And I think we can also just kind of rotate these a little bit. That. Just make this much bigger. And then we kind of do the same sculpture stuff I was doing before. Y, G. Why that needs to be much thinner. Okay. We're actually gonna give the ground a material, so I'm gonna kind of see it see the crap easier. Nice. Okay. Object, origin, geometry, control tab, scholar, shift R around. There, control R. Oops, Oops. Oops. nice and smooth. Smooth, and you know what? I'm actually just gonna no, no. keep them separate for now so I can pose them. But I'm gonna go ahead and combine them all in a little bit. For now, just keep them the same. Sculpt mode, Shift R, Control R. Smooth it a little bit, just a little bit more. Nice taper. Back to our object mode. Please let me go to object mode. Sculpt mode. Ooh. Lift R. Right around there. Control R. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Make it nice and spiky. Okay. Now we have. A leg. Grab a leg. We'll combine it. And we're going to say add modifier mirror. Set it to that mirror object. So we got what one leg. And we'll make another. Z. 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 If they get smaller as they go, so we'll just kind of shrink them. Crabs have eight. Right, just like a spider. One, two, three, four. Right, so it's one, two, three, one, two, three, and then the crab, uh, claw, crab claw one. Oops. Each one. There. Cool, 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 cool. Um, so L, L, R, we'll rotate it, R, rotate it just a little bit, and reverse that selection, try, up, rotate it too, just to give the visuals, oops, no, oops. Nice. Okay. Looking crappy. Um, 
And I'm actually gonna just play around with the textures a bit. Later, a bit later. <laughs> yeah, for now, I wanna put the colors on, but not just yet. All right, so for one of these, duplicate. Move it forward, G, Y, R, Z. And we'll give them the pinchies. Give them the pinchy. I like these claws. Uh, so we'll go in here, and for all of these, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a big puff here. Yeah, something like that. Joint at least. Back to ours. Okay. So it's rather crab like, I think. And let's go to the top. Wait, what's this one look like? Can I move it? <clears throat> Oop, my mouse is messed up. All right, we'll move you here, and I just want to see. It's so kind of long and spindly. I think for this, we already have this kind of bigger section. Just the big one, and then I just do this in sculpt mode. Just control, control tab, sculpt mode, Hold R. Now we're gonna snake hook, snarky, pull it, pull it, control R. Difficult for some reason, so we'll look up the original plan. Shift F and it looks basically like this. Basically like that. <laughs> and I think the claw options like this. Let's see. We'll say. Just keep combining them. Control J. Objects. Set, da, da, origin geometry. Uh, tab. Sculpt. Shift R. Mm. It's skewed. Sculpt mode, shift R, right around there, control R, just shrink that. Yeah. Oh, that looks all right. I'm not going to worry about it too much. And Make it bigger here. And combine. 
<laughs> nice. Grabby boy. Control tab, sculpt mode, control R. Now it's all just one piece. And we kind of go in and add some nice little spikies. Give it a little more interest, visual interest. Some like that. Let's move this one out. I need to get a pinch going for right here. Draw, make that a little more puffed. Stay puffed. Yeah, yeah. And I'm just going to rotate it a little. All right. Mm -mm -mm. Do this thing real quick. Lock it. Let's make this leg a little bigger. Balanced. And you know, let's just make this taller. Object, set our general geometry. Yeah. 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 That's looking pretty good. I'm gonna get another one of these. I'll be right back. I return. <laughs> so, crap. Um, so I want the guy, the crab centaur. He'll be up top, right? That's my cat. She's fine. She's like yelling. As cats do. Okay, perfect. Displace. Another sub B on there. Just give everything a little. There. Yeah. Sand is what? That color? Cool. Looks like he's sitting on sand. All right. That's for the crab. So that. It's using these colors. Shading new. Front. Front this way. Tab A U. Project from vehicle. Now we will go image texture. Find. Correct crab image. Uh, I think it's this one. UV editing. Yeah, got it right. Go here. Nice. <laughs> we'll see how this works. E, turn, right? 
<laughs> yeah, we'll see. <laughs> That's, I like that a lot better. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Then we'll give these little armies the same material. Grab. Grab. Oh, grab. 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 It's unfortunate. I should have UV mapped these before arms but that's fine and they you project from you that what's that like nice and this one a you project from you it's working out pretty well actually And then we can do fun stuff too, where we go back to the shading and we're going to feed this color ramp into a bumpy color here, color, height, normal, bam. Oh, it's bumping now. And we'll kind of clean it up a little bit. Flip them. Yeah, because I want the crevices. Crevices. Put one. Just kind of lower the strength till we get a little bit of texture. Not like a crazy amount, just enough to for some visual interest. There. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good if I say so myself. Crabs are wet. I guess technically they're not. Well, that's a weird thought. And relatively not wet underwater, but whatever. Tomato, tomato. We'll lower the roughness just yeah yeah what shit smells like mm. all right crabby's looking pretty good and we'll just make some sand real quick Oops, then locks up. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Crabby. I'm feeling a little crabby. Do a light area. S ten. Five hundred. Blue. That looks okay. Grab it. So we're just going to get an image out of this and then bring it into Photoshop. Something like this. Shift A, view, camera, align, where is it? Align view, active camera to view, perfect. Cool. 
Let's have two cameras. Just this camera. I think that's looking pretty good. So, maybe for the fun stuff. Okay, this is gonna be a crab centaur man. Crab tar. Let's go ahead and just kind of get in here. Put in a few more details. These eyes to be a bit bigger. Like that. Kind of stretch them out too. Then also just go to shrimp. Spike Roonies. Just goofing right now. I think we can also just go. Yeah, oh, that looks cool. I love the, the snake, snake pill, that's what it's called. Reminds me of uh, Johnny Quest <laughs> when I was a kid. Yeah, you know, the big crab or spider robot thing. Yeah, that looks cool. Got to fix the eye a little bit. Control tab. It's called. Does fucked. And object mode. I do think we're gonna make it look for again. Catch some of those highlights. Yeah. And clear cut too. Make sure that this is feeding at the clear cut. Oops. That was. And just a few more lights. Light. There. Could be yellow and 50. I don't know. Oh, that looks. Radius, get bigger, 200. Okay, kind of counteracts that uh, blue. Oops, the color's out. It's gonna darken the background a little bit. Something like that. Oh. Doesn't be quite ready. Um, I'm gonna get a tangerine. I'll be right back.
Yummy. If you guys like what I'm doing, please hit that follow button. Do a lot of art. That's all I do. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Crab looking pretty good. But it's not a crab man. Which is what we really need. But just to get in the wallet thinking about it. Just add some variety to this. Yeah, I like that a lot, actually. Oops. Okay. So there. Cool, that gives that the whole image a lot more variety. Okay. Now, crab man. What do you think? Should it be riding the crab or should it be centaur? style the crab i kind of like the centaur idea <clears throat> so file import fbx it's from last year We all OBJs, huh? Low poly, human hands, male poly, male, 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 male. Okay, cancel, file, import, OBJ. Then we go to boom, bada boom, resources, male, female, let's do the female. Oh, it's supposed to be a crab man, but I'm gonna make it a crab lady. And just turn it. Sorry, no legs for you. Five. Object set of origin, origin geometry, and center you. I think you're centered. Can't tell. Guess it doesn't really matter. Make right there. Yeah. Boop. 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 Nice. Now, we're going to do a better view. tab sculpt mode pose tool is going to be our friend here And just some quick kit bashing.
<laughs> do I want to give her claw arms? <laughs> I kind of do. She might as well have both, right? Sculpt. This out of the way. There. Oh, what are you looking like? A little goofy. That's okay. We'll do a U, check for view, UV editing. Hard to make out everything that's going on, but. I'll be bringing this into Photoshop and kind of painting over it, so it should look a little bit better. Get some more dramatic lighting to help break it up too. Yeah, that's much cooler. Cool. Definitely dig that more. <laughs> and film, transparent. Our backgrounds and stuff. I'll do one more area light over here on this side. Make it a lot less powerful. Nope. And like a yet. Feel like that brings out a lot of the, the details. Cool. Weird. Fun. E. So I'm gonna go ahead and take and make I'm gonna separate them in widgets. So first collection. Oh, it's all in quick shape. And I just forgot to do this. Um, fuck it, whatever. I'm just going to render it out. So, boom. Image save. Crab man. Crab man. Render. Save. Boom. Exit. Exit. And I said Photoshop, but I meant to save this clip studio.
Okay. Do do do. File. Open. Render. Perfect. Make a new layer. Bada boom. Save. Crab man. Wait. Save as a clip. Save as a clip file. Thank you. Cool. Airbrush. Do do do. Crabby. Feeling crabby, guys. Yeah. Fruit is the best. So I'm going to bring in those crab images I had from earlier. Nine. Crab reference. Where's it going to start? Layering that in here. What? Crab. Yes. Yes. Move that over there. That will. Here is got me stand. Got me stamp. Match. Yeah. yeah. Why isn't working? Everything else works, right? Okay, that's working fine. Copy state. Probably only works on the same layer, huh? Or do I have to convert right here? That was it right there. Perfect. Quick tutorial search. Clip Studio Copy. Please. Click it.
only works on a single layer. I am on that layer. That's definitely working. Clip Studio Copy Stamp. Should just be working. <sighs> Do I have to be using a brush? No. Oh, pick up color, obtain display color. Yeah, that's what I want. Reference image, top layer. There we go. Okay. I don't know what I was intending to do there. Okay. So brush sands. Yeah. Ink. A Pasadena. Pen brusher. Paint some. But that's okay. I think we'll just go ahead and start painting as well. I'm going to take this color, put it on this right here so we can start getting some nice texture. I like how this is coming out. A lot of like little details to pull out of the crap. Should probably give it some teeth of some sort. Do that. Block it out. I like this bone colors. Maybe a little different. Didn't really mean to line it up with a Potosi, but <laughs> it's okay. It happens. And it's gonna be B or P P P P P P P pencil. Oh yeah, color pencil. So.
do 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 oh of course it's getting a little busy so let's go ahead and start doing some things to just block out some of these shapes so it's got that B, B, go in here and darken it out right here. Yes, that looks good. And do another lasso here. Oh, I should have this down as a clipping mask. There we go. And as well, one more lasso thing right here. It's actually just reverse the selection, grab this and go back to the soft and we're just gonna add some some highlight on the crab hand. Kind of pop that out too. And bam, 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 bam. go into color pencil, add some little details. Something to just a little something, something, you know? Just a little something, something. Like that. Yeah, for drawing, it's really just about the shape of your stroke over the, uh, over anything else. You just want to make sure that you're going to have a nice little curve or something. And let's go back to the clone stamp tool. And we're going to select this little goopy thing. And we're going to cry that it's not working. It's visible to new layer now. I want to merge select that to new layer. Um, so it does all have to be the same there. Uh, all right, let's then let's duplicate. Turn. Oop. Du duplicate. Du what? Duplicate. Oh, it's because it uh, puts it there. And let's do folder. Drop those in there. Drop those in our folder. Duplicate. Hide. It's back on. Please. Dear God. Merge. Now I can go to this. Put a little warning though. Starting to. Gonna make them look a little more sick. But we'll see if we'll have to do that in a different way. Let me just darken the one over the other one. And we're gonna the highlight as well, of course. Boom. It's got all those like fly compound eyes, so some hashing. Pop it out. Bada boom. Darken this bad. Yeah, let's kind of separate all these little shapes. 
Right, that looks pretty good. Need to make this right here, this area much more cohesive. I think we'll just kind of darken out this shape here, this background shape. Make our eyes move up a little bit more. Darken that. Some cleavage. <laughs> and <laughs> it's so funny that it's just crab head up top. Sure, what to pick up here? What I should do, I should say. I think we'll just kind of play around. See what happens. See what happens. Like that. It's funky. Funkiness. It's funky, funky. And I think we'll just get the blur tool here. It's going to blur out some of the stuff so that our face is a little bit easier to read. Okay. Just playing around now. Popping in certain details, popping in others. Okay. Oops. I think overall that's that's pretty nice. I think we just want to break this up with some pencil strokes so people know that it's painted. But I think overall that's, that came out really well for a like 15 minute sketch. Or it's probably been an hour now. That came out pretty well. Let's go ahead and add some kelp and shit. So, see floor images. Copy image, paste image. The image behind everything. Onto something like that. No. Overlay. Duplicate. Control T. Okay. I'll combine these. Put them back to overlay. Eraser. Light rays. Don't want anything interfering with the view of the lady crab. And as well, we'll just do another like this blue that was in there. Okay, change pixel. Normal, normal. Press density, turn that way down. Just make it pop in there. 
the look. Color margin. Color margin two. Perfect. And also just kind of paint in, paint it in a little bit. Let's get it a little nice and Why isn't it working? Um, what? What is preventing me from dropping it on this? Oh, of course. Stroker, please. Just actually put some of these rocks here as well. Merge select the layers. What overlay? What does that look like? Uh, just soft line. Yeah, that looks good. And last but not least, we'll do some sort of. And breaks the crap out of it. Let's see if we can get it to be a bit of a hue. It seems that if it was the right hue, it's just too saturated. Something like that. Just a little texture, you know? And what else? I don't know. Kind of goofing around. 
Foxy Whiting. Underwater lighting. Monarchy under lighting. I suppose it's just adding. Okay, so we'll do take this layer. We're just gonna just gonna fill it. Turn down the opacity a bunch. Make it much darker. There. Let's add a mask to this one. Like a nice underwater vibe. Another layer. This time we're looking for some like scattered. But, uh, we'll turn down the layer too. Particles in the air. Put the mics on. That is okay. <laughs> Would have been a bummer to find out now. Okay. Need we just a few more things. Control A, new layer, edit. Come on. Draw on, draw inside. Filter, blur, Gaussian blur. Filter, blur, Gaussian blur. From the fifty. Then control A. Edit. Just a few more tricks up my sleeve. Control A, G, G, boom. Take this there. Filter. Effect. I do distort. May not be. Definitely noise, but it does not appear that they have that. Then we'll just go ahead and add a add a adjustment. New correction. Color balance. Do do do. It's a cyan. 
skin tone, make it blue. For the highlights, let's make them yellow. Yellow. Just a little yellow, not crazy yellow. Shadows, different. Oh, I think I went the other way on that. Yeah, I want to go this way. Green. Uh, create folder, insert the layers, merge selected layers, no, merge visible to new layer, um, merge visible to new layer, and then this one, filter, blur, Gaussian. Right there. Okay. And mask B B. Width and soft. Turn my brush density back up. A little further up. Okay, whatever. Delete mask. We'll just erase this. Didn't really want to do that, but left no choice. Just fade in the rest. Now we think it's just a little bit of blur. <laughs> that came out pretty well. Definitely like the uh, Blender workflow. Uh, what next? Let's go ahead and. Uh, Sam, art station. Got a different font, it's a little cooler. Okay. Uh. Text color. I want to change it. I want to change the text color. Uh, 
Nice. Okay. Last thing, 7E5, welcome. Thank you for the cheer. Oh, thank you for the pits and murder. You followed me uh, just now. I appreciate uh, you guys doing so. I was just reaching the end of my, my day here, but I made a crab lady. <laughs> She's a bit crabby. <laughs> but yeah, having fun messing around with that and uh, hope you guys get a kick out of it too. Last touch is to add my signature. We'll do pencil. Pencil again. Cool. Mechanical. But I certainly appreciate the bits. That is very kind of you. Oops. We'll do. Bam. Bam. It's always a little rough putting on my signature. I don't know why. Dun, 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 dun. Why is it so difficult? <laughs> it's my signature. And we'll just make it a little transparent. Because I like that. Nice. That came out well. Came out well. It's kind of like the fucked up things in the game The Forest. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> I'll definitely take that as a compliment because I love, love Forest. That was a lot of... A lot of fun things that they did there. That's why I'm actually ending my day. Uh, I thank you. You guys kind of caught me at the, the tail end of my work here. But I will be back soon. Uh, probably doing some sculpture. 7 e 5 Really good. glad I stumbled on your stream. I'm glad you stumbled on my stream. Um, uh, if you have any questions, you're, you're welcome to reach out to me at any time. But let's see. For time-wise... I uh, should have time tomorrow, so I'll be back on roughly the same time, hopefully a little bit longer. Um, it's only seven. Uh, I'm getting old. I'll probably be in bed soon. Anyway, I'll be back on tomorrow. Hopefully, I'll catch you then. Uh, thank you for everyone who's tuned in. I'll be posting this on YouTube as well, so uh, people can get kind of a time lapse, and I might do some narration over that. But thank you again for everyone tuning in, and I hope you have a great night. Good night, everyone.